It's very clear to all that the protests have been hijacked by criminal elements and other groups that do not mean well for the country. I want to remind all Nigerians that while it is a constitutional right to participate in peaceful protest, it is also an offense and a crime to engage in disorder, violence, and chaos. Does it imply for the local markets? Because we're trying to address the interest of all the stakeholders. Most of these food items who's, that is going to enjoy these duty waivers and concessions are also being cultivated by Nigerian farmers. And so there is the interest to strike, there is the issue of striking uh, a balance between the interests, the long-term interests of Nigerian farmers, Nigerian stakeholders who are involved in the productions of these items and the short-term interest of uh, addressing food inflation. Group of people who started campaign, subversive campaign, waving flags of other countries and openly calling for military takeover of government. This is not a protest but an offense of treason. I want to use this opportunity to warn our youths to desist from accepting foreign flags from agents of destabilization. On behalf of the officers and soldiers of the Nigerian army, state unequivocally that the Nigerian army stand assured in defense of our democracy, of our peace, of our harmony, and we are not going to shift ground on that. The Nigerian army will not sit by and watch the nation slide into anarchy. Accordingly, the truth of the Nigerian army will continue to work in conjunction with other security agencies in the population space to maintain law and order. On our part, the armed forces of Nigeria, we've been doing all that we need to do to ensure that we provide the enabling environment to support Mr. President and this government in the attainment of this objective of reducing poverty and hardship in this country. Particularly the Nigerian Navy, we have been working assiduously towards addressing the issue of insecurity in our maritime environment, and this has so far been paying positive, uh, really positive results, leading to the uh, increase in our oil production, which is the mainstay of our economy.